So Billy, I understand that you get a lot of joy out of gardening and it almost makes you feel like dancing. It does. Can you show me that dance routine? Absolutely. I could do this all night long. During the spring, summer, and fall of 2011, Abington gardener Bill Davis shared many tips. Don't be afraid to go up high on the plant. Tips to grow vegetables, from potatoes to scallions, and many varieties in between. That's one nice looking eggplant. Hey, how does your garden grow? Hey, how does your garden grow? Hey, now we're gardening with Bill. Billy, as he is known to his friends, shared his recipe for great soil. This is the stuff that feeds the plants. Starting with his game plan and planting the seed. Here's a, a wax bean that I soaked, and here's one that hasn't been soaked. And experimenting. This is a technique I came up with like 15 years ago. And what I did was I drilled three holes in here and then put some, some eye bolts through there. And he kept us dreaming about the great harvest. If I have enough time tonight, I'll be pulling out well over 300 pounds of cucumbers. One ingredient, the main ingredient, really the most crucial to the recipe of any great garden. I do this because uh, I just love doing it. Life is good out here. And he loves saving money. It gives me healthy food that I know what I'm eating, and uh, it's saving me money. Sa it saves me a lot of money. Yes, it's truly like visiting the rainforest of the Northeast. I'm in here. So we're going to mix up our Epsom salt with the garden sulfur. And we learned so many valuable lessons. It's awesome. It will uh, produce more flowers on the plant, which will produce more peppers. And techniques. This is one of the reasons why I do bare feet, so I can stick my feet on underneath the vines, so I'm not stepping on the vines even a thrifty way to water the plants. I'm just watering where the, where the roots are going into the ground. I'm not watering all the dead space there. And how to make a very special tea. I'm going to take all this material and just put it in there for the winter. Let it stew up. Somehow, before we knew it, the season of 2011 was over. And it was time to put the garden to bed. But all winter long, Billy's been working on his wood ash. And this is the, this ash will really make it pop. And his compost pile. For the winter time now, I'm gonna take, and give this a good coat of lime too. And now, you can meet Abington gardener Bill Davis in person. This one's got my name on it. To learn some tips. Weeding, it doesn't take that much time, if you know these little secrets. Get inspired. Look at the size of these bad boys. And join in by sharing your own special knowledge at e-awakening.com's second garden get together. It's free to the public and whether you're an experienced gardener or have never played in the dirt, you'll be most welcomed at the garden get together. It's at the Abington Library in the Copeland Room on March 8th from 7 to 8 p.m. Let's plant the seed and make our gardens grow. Hey how does your garden grow? Hey, how does your garden grow? Hey, now we're gardening with Bill. We're gardening, gardening with Bill. Thank you, Bill. <laughs>